Hi, and welcome to the first video in our mini-series showcasing some of the beautiful, quaint towns on Cape Cod, Massachusetts. In this video, we are exploring the cozy, picturesque town of Chatham, which is located at the southeastern tip of the Cape. This upscale seaside town was first settled by the English in 1664 and was incorporated as a town in 1712. Today, this historical resort town boasts a charming, walkable main street, oceanfront lodging, beautiful beaches, and lots to explore. We started our morning with a caffeine kick from Chatham Park, which is less than two miles from downtown Chatham on Route 28. They have a fantastic selection of breakfast and lunch sandwiches, and their baked goods sell fast. Chatham's charm is perhaps most pronounced along its walkable, endearing Main Street, which is home to beautiful boutiques, tasty eateries, specialty shops and galleries, cozy inns, and a lovely, relaxed vibe. There is something for everyone on Chatham's Main Street. We visited in March, and many shops and cafes were closed, but that didn't stop us from enjoying the beautiful window displays, including counting ducks at Ducks in the Window. We peeked into Chatham Candy Manor to admire their colorful cases of creative, homemade confections, which they've been churning out since 1955. In the center of town, Kate Gould Park offers a pretty green space to relax from the hustle of Main Street. Flanked by the Wild Goose Tavern, it's here where the Chatham Band has been performing summer concerts on the bandstand for decades. <laughs> a short walk from Main Street is the historical Chatham Godfrey Windmill. Built in 1797, this gristmill ground grain commercially until 1898. It's a beautiful spot for a family photo, and keep an eye out for the tranquil labyrinth. We challenge you to walk the entire path without getting dizzy. About a mile north of Main Street is the Chatham Pier and Fish Market. Open seasonally, this spot is a must-see on your Chatham visit. Pick up locally caught seafood to cook at home, or order from their classic New England menu, which features the amazing variety the ocean has to offer. This pier is also known as the perfect place to watch seals in the summer. Half a mile from downtown is Chatham Lighthouse Beach, the largest beach in town. It always draws a crowd for its stunning expanse of dunes, nature walks, and constantly changing surf and scenery. Bring a picnic, set out your blanket, and enjoy watching the fishing boats and seasonal seals gliding by. There's no lifeguard at Chatham Lighthouse Beach, so be sure to note the signage that marks the no-swim areas. And during the busy season, the parking lot fills up fast, so arrive early. Towering above Chatham Lighthouse Beach is the iconic Chatham Light, an operational lighthouse that's rich in history. Originally, two wooden structures were erected here in 1808 to guide maritime traffic through the often dangerous waters near Chatham. The tower you see today is one of the two cast iron towers built in 1877. Today, the lighthouse is operated by the U.S. Coast Guard and is occasionally open to tourists in the summer. While you're in Chatham, venture further off of Main Street to find a variety of additional impressive attractions. To get a true appreciation of what life in Chatham was like 100 years ago, visit the Atwood Museum. Here you can explore a carefully preserved historical house museum from the 1920s. You'll see a working lantern house from one of the historic Chatham Twin Lights, and you can enjoy several art galleries. A stone's throw from the Chatham Perk Coffee Shop is the Atlantic White Shark Conservancy's Shark Center. This interactive center seeks to educate the public about the great white shark and the groundbreaking research currently underway in the Cape Cod region. As you head west on Route 28 out of town, be sure to stop at Chatham Village Cafe and Bakery for lunch and a sweet treat. We tried their cinnamon donut and turkey sandwiches and were not disappointed. 
Our last stop on our way out of Chatham was at Chatham Pottery to peek in the windows at their beautiful Cape Cod inspired, handmade and hand painted stoneware. Be sure to watch this space for more videos about the beautiful towns on the Cape. If you enjoyed this video, consider liking and sharing it. And if you would like to see more beautiful travel destinations, please subscribe to our channel. We wish you safe travels. Until next time.